The heroes now needed to encourage Celius to fight his own shadow, which he had himself summoned using his father's spellbooks. And here was the problem. What could the three heroes do for Celius, if only the prince himself could defeat this villain? And what sort of nightmares did the shadow have in store for them all? Shadow and half ice. Excuse us, young prince, but you're giving us no choice here. The peaceful resolution seemed now impossible. Despite all that, I'm still not dead. Shall we go another round? I have all the time in the world. You foolish boy. 
Your light cannot harm me. The light isn't for you. It's for me. No, wait! Don't take me back! You'll regret this! Think how you'll have to guard me day and night! I'll poison your thoughts! Nothing worse than what you've already put me through. Well, thank you for returning me to my imprisoned stay at the Astral Academy. Oh, I'm sure they'll be much more lenient with how much you've learned during this journey. Yes, maybe they'll only lock me up at night. Sounds like progress to me. I wish I could reward you all somehow, but I don't have anything. Don't worry about it. Good luck. What an adventure. It was nice to be of help to someone. Not just, you know, skeleton deconstruction. I see what you mean. And I agree. Lifting someone up instead of putting down goblins. Oh, that reminds me. I have a pie-eating contest to get to. Sounds like we're ready to head our own ways again. Who knows what kind of trouble will find us next. Maybe an army of enraged, enchanted hogs. No, I think those already got taken care of. Until we meet again.